I'm Pastor Dan from Three Crosses Kinlands Arena. I'm here with Jet McCord and Mike Lane. We've got a horsemanship clinic coming up June the 27th here at Three Crosses. Jet's an instructor in equine communication. Isn't that right, Jet? Yes, sir. And and that's what that's what the biggest uh, our biggest goal for the clinic is going to be is developing a relationship with your horse and learning learning to trust your horse and getting your horse to trust you and also learning to respect your horse and getting your horse to respect you. And, you know, building that relationship with your horse, it just makes it easier to communicate with them. It makes your horse safer, and it just makes your horse all around more enjoyable. And I see a lot of people even that are, that are excellent trainers and can get a horse to do a lot of things, but still have trouble building that relationship. And really horsemanship is just about that. It's a lot of building those relationships and and it just makes the, the entire experience more enjoyable for you and the horse both. What kind of rider would this clinic be beneficial for? Any kind. Uh, we're not going to focus so much on, on the finer points of horsemanship. Uh, it'll be more on, more on um, kind of a broader scale of, of, that, of that building relationship type, uh, type of horsemanship. And even, even people that have a horse that's uh, that's well broke or one that they're competing on, maybe team roping on or whatever, um, but they they just have trouble with him, you know, outside the arena. The horse won't stand still, or um, you know, he does this or he does that. You know, all those little habits and and those little things that, that kind of annoy us about our horses. Um, those are things that that we can address and that we can fix. So it's going to be it's going to be more for you know for for kind of everybody. Sounds like a beginner or even up to an experienced rider can learn something here as yes, far as, as uh, how to make their horse just act better a little bit all around. Right, and, and that's like I said, there's even a lot of experienced riders that, um, you know, they're experienced riders and they do well and they compete well, but they still have trouble relating to the horse. Yeah. And, and those are the kind of people that a lot of times will have trouble starting colts or if they get a horse that they're having problems with, they have trouble fixing those problems because there, it's just a communication barrier and they're having trouble communicating with their horse and telling their horse what they want. And then it also goes both ways that, uh, you know, sometimes they have trouble reading their horse and, and figuring out what the problem is and pinpointing those type of problems. And, and uh, so it'll be, it'll be kind of for all levels. Um, you know, obviously the, the beginners and, and those kind of riders are gonna get more out of it than maybe a more experienced rider. But I think uh, I think anybody that comes will be able to benefit. Somebody with a, an experienced rider with a well, like you said, with a horse that has a, a certain problem, uh, you can help them work on that area. Even though they may have had years of riding experience, there may be some things that that uh, like me, you know, I have a hard time getting a horse to do a certain thing. I could come in, you could help me correct that. And that that's the same way with me. Uh, you know, I've been riding horses all of my life, and and it wasn't until recently. I say recently, in the last 10 years, that I realized that there's there's more to riding my horse than just getting on and taking off. Yeah. And once I realized that that if I'll build that communication and, and build that relationship with my horse, it makes everything that I do easier, whether I'm training or riding or competing, all of those things get easier and and just make it more enjoyable for me and the horse. What is this clinic going to cost? It's going to cost $100 to come participate, and when I say participate, all the participants will be able to bring their own horse, and, and we're going to be in the arena with them, and we're going to look at those problems, see what, what problems they're having, and address those problems right there with their horse. And obviously, you're not going to be able to fix every horse in, a, in an eight-hour day, but at least be able to give people the tools that they can use that when they go home, they can use those tools, and they have have a place to start and at least they know the direction that they're headed with it. And uh, tell us again when it is this? It'll be June 27th. Uh, we're going to start at 9 o'clock in the morning 
and uh, we'll go till till about five o'clock that afternoon. Okay. Uh, do they need to uh, send in a deposit if they want to secure the Yes, deposit? sir. And we're we're doing we're doing a deposit so that way we know uh, for sure who all is coming. Uh, just makes it easier for us and for them also. It's a refundable deposit, so if something happens, you can't make it. We'll give the deposit back, but. Um, but there's a $50 deposit to reserve your spot. It's a it's a limited number of entries, so we don't get too many people. And uh, it'll be it's a $50 deposit, and then of course it's free to come watch. Anybody that just wants to come out and sit and watch the watch the clinic are more than welcome to come out. And who knows, you might learn something that way too. That's right. Uh, Let me ask you, Jet, uh, one question here on the handbills and everything we've talked about and stuff in the, in the past when we was coming to do this clinic and you talked about this. One thing I really liked on your hook, I call it a hook on your handbills, is helping people one horse at a time. Tell us how you come about that. Well, the, the biggest thing for me, um, you know, most people, most people focus so much on the horse that they kind of forget about themselves. Mm -hmm. And any, any horse, any horse will, will come to the rider's level. And what I mean by that is a very inexperienced rider a lot of times when you put them on a really broke horse, it's not very long that the horse will be less broke. And then the opposite is also true, that if you take a horse that's less broke and you give them to a very experienced rider that's a good trainer, the horse will rise to their level. So when I say helping people one horse at a time, I want to be able to help people get in tune with their horse, build a relationship with their horse, and whether you're teaching him to, to cross water or trail ride or you're trying to teach him to bow or whatever you're doing, that relationship that you build with your horse is what is what really makes the difference. When your horse trusts you and respects you, it doesn't matter what you go do. And when you do that, the benefits of that for the people are just innumerable. Um, you know, it's just it's just so much more pleasant to be with your horse. They're so much more enjoyable to be around. And I, I just want to be able to share with, with other people um, all of the things that, that I've gained and benefited from, from horsemanship. And I think that's the big part of helping people. Um, you know, if I, if I can help people to do that and, and to gain the confidence and the patience and, and the tools that they need to get along with their horse, um, you know, I can help the horse a lot by helping the people. Great. Where do they, where can they contact you? Just give me a call, and uh, my address isn't on the on the bill. But just give me a call at 580-235-2220, uh, and um, I can give you the address and reserve him, reserve him a spot. And sounds, ready for them. sounds like this can fill up pretty fast. So if they're, if they're interested, they probably ought to give you a call pretty quick. Yeah, we've already out. we've already got several entries, and um, and we're not even to the first of June. So there's been several people call and and are sending their deposit now. So um, so anybody that wants to come, just go ahead and send it in and we'll get them a spot. Give us that number one more time. 580-235-2220. Thank you, Jeff. Thank, Thank you. Jeff. you.